All right, man, listen. This is going to be a video where it's just me talking. And it's an interesting one because I feel like I've gone into a point on this game where I just it's 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 fun sometimes and sometimes it's not. And I feel like early so early on that's a problem, man. Like I saw this tweet today from Nick as in like Nick 28T on Twitter and I want to see if I can pull it up for you guys man uh, but welcome back to a brand new video I hope you guys are doing well today um, I had a pretty decent day didn't do too hot on weekend leak speaking of weekend leak let's scroll over here and right now we are currently we are currently six in five which of course is pretty bad um, in my opinion and I was four and one earlier today and I just went on a bad streak where I just, one, wasn't playing well, two, my opponents were just kind of, I, I feel like my opponents were kind of just a little bit better there, um, here and there for the most part. But let me close all these tabs and then I'm going to show you the tweet that I'm going to be basing this video off of, which, excuse me, sorry, I just I drank some water, came back from the gym and all that stuff. Um, how do I display capture? Here we go. I hope this doesn't show anything I don't want to show. Okay, so here we are. This is OBS. Let's. Oh, I'm I'm losing frames here. Let's close that. Okay, so here we are. These frauds sold us a lie. Let me. Let, should I minimize this? I could probably minimize this. These frauds sold us a lie with the beta and early access gameplay. FIFA 20 in its current state is a scam compared to what we had early. They made fools of all of us. Zero skill gap, AI defending his back, button delay worse than ever, drop back, RNG, disgusting. Now, let me just say, I don't agree with this comment. Speaking of which, let me... No, 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 sorry, there you go, goodbye, Brandon, see you later, um, but, if I'm being honest, man, if I'm being real, let's go back to FIFA, um, if I'm being honest, that tweet just shows so, so much of what has happened, in my opinion, the past couple weeks, months, whatever, since the game was released, now, I loved, and I mean loved this game when it first came out as in beta when i got the beta and i got to play ultimate team with those all great players against just people random people i i made a video i made it like a 10 15 minute video talking about why i love fifa 20 and why i think it could be the best fifa of all time and we go into the game the game is released and we see the button delay in rivals that's the first bad step Second bad step, AI defending is back and probably better than ever. Uh, AI defending, and the big problem is that manual defending it actually works. Manual defending actually works, which is something we wanted, and which is something that's great. Don't get me wrong. There's nothing wrong with manual defending, but if you have manual defending that's good, and you have AI defending, and you have drop back all in the same game, and you're not fixing any one of them in your first, like, what, one or two patches or title updates? Like, I'm, I'm not saying, oh, I could go to the offices right now and fix it myself in five minutes. No, I'm not saying that. I know it takes time. I know it takes process. It, it's a, pro it's a pros process. Process. And that it might have to go through tens of people uh, to get tested and to get coded into the game and make sure it's right or, or it makes sure the game actually plays how they want to play it, um, how they want it to be played. But man, th th this is just, it's unacceptable. It's just unacceptable. We got duped. We got lied to. They were like, hey guys, here's a great football game where it actually takes skill. The passing is great. There's no to little button delay. Here you guys go. This is FIFA 20. And then they're like, hey guys, here's an update. We're gonna make FIFA 20 better. And they put it through the ground. And now it's done. It's done. Like, at, at this point, I want it to be fixed, but I just don't know if it will be. Um, in my opinion, even if the delay does stay, which there is some clear delay, for me, it's not that big of an issue. 
because I have an Ethernet cable, so that does help me. Um, I feel like if they had to fix one thing, it would be the AI defending. Uh, because if you don't have AI defending, people who use Dropback, yes, they will still be kind of annoying. Um, but I feel like if AI defending, AI blocks, and all that stuff goes away, it will be much better. Because if manual defending is the main thing you have to do, you will get rewarded. Hopefully, they fix their actually getting rewarded for tackles. And not even that, but just actually winning tackles when you're supposed to win it. Basically, the same thing. I, I just repeated myself. Um but they shouldn't. There shouldn't be automatic interceptions. There shouldn't be AI defending, AI lunging, anything like that. I don't think that should be in the game at all. Um, and if that is in the game, it's it's just gonna continue not being a fun, fun game, man. And it's frustrating, you know. I'm I'm I feel like I'm very good at this game compared compared to last year and the, even the year before. I feel like this is since all the weekend leagues have been out. I feel like this is the game I'm best at. And maybe it's because I have a great team. Maybe it's because I don't know. But I just think they could really fix this. And I really hope they do, man. This is where I'll win the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. I'll see you guys next video. Have a sick day. And I'm out.